ever stumbled upon a penny that could change your life? Meet the 1909 VDB Lincoln Cent with the double die obverse, DDO, a true gem in the numismatic world. Let's dive into what makes this coin so fascinating and valuable, especially for those just starting their collecting journey. The 1909 VDB Lincoln Cent is a treasure, not just because it marks the debut of the iconic Lincoln Cent series, but due to a captivating mint error known as the double die obverse. So what exactly does this mean? During the minting process, the die used to strike the coin was imprinted twice with a slight misalignment. This results in noticeable doubling of elements on the coin, particularly on the date and the word liberty. For novice collectors, spotting this doubling can be thrilling. Look closely at the 1909 date and liberty on the coin. If you see a shadowy doubled image, you might have stumbled upon a DDO. These details can be subtle, so a magnifying glass can help. The 1909 VDB Lincoln Cent is already significant due to its connection to Victor David Brenner, the coin's designer. However, the DDO variety is exceedingly rare. Precise mintage numbers for this error aren't available, but it's known to be a scarce find, making it a coveted item for collectors. This coin's rarity translates directly into its value. A superb gem, particularly one in MS67 Red, Mint State 67 with full red color, can fetch a premium price. At auction, such coins have sold for impressive amounts, reflecting their desirability and the market's recognition of their rarity. Superb gems, coins classified as red, retain their original coppery color without any brown toning, significantly increasing their appeal and value. For the 1909 VDB DDO, a superb gem with a full red designation in high mint state is particularly valuable, often commanding top prices at auctions. For instance, an MS67 superb gem fetched over $15,000 at heritage auctions. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe for more numismatic treasures and tips. Let's keep the coin collecting passion alive.